But would you look at that timing? And since right when I was leaving, Shadow decided to give me another hydrate. We gonna hydrate. All right. I just realized how close to death I was again. Uh, put that away. Now I'm gonna go across the bridge to the embassies. So I went all the way in the wrong direction. Finish that one up. Then Well, I gotta find whatever person that was. But I think that's it, right? I just gotta do the I'm not doing is it worth it? Does anybody know? Jelly, do you know? Is the profit one worth it, or can I stand? I am gonna save. That's the, the office of the person with the thing. Seltane! Hello there, human. Sincere apology, but I am here on business and cannot be distracted right now. You want me to, to you really want me to go talk to Conrad? Seriously? Curious. What do you know about the consort and her relationship to me? It was a Turian named Septimus who found out your secret. Unbelieving, I know How long? Septimus, and he could not learn my secrets. The only way he could learn them is from the Asari consort. Not true. Look at this. Confused. This is difficult to fathom. If the Turian could learn this on his own... All game? Made, Anyone can discover my secret. Septimus is a powerful man, and it wasn't easy for him to find. Relieved. I suppose you are correct, human. Thank you for this information. Startled realization. I must speak with the consort. She will be most displeased with my actions. Anxious request. Please, human. If you will excuse me, I must go now. So you're telling me I should go start that quest, huh? So long. Farewell, human. Thankful. That was a great thing you did, Commander. Approving. You see, Dan, not all humans are as you say. I'm sure the Earth Clan stands to profit from this in some way. Dude, all this human hate. I mean, I get it. We suck, but come on. Alright, where the hell was Conrad? He was in the markets, right? Alright, let's go talk to fucking Conrad. You're Commander Shepard, the hero of Eden Prime. Uh -huh. I am so honored to meet you. Do I know you? Uh, no, no, I'm just a fan. One of your biggest fans, actually. My name I is Conrad. Fans. Conrad Vernon. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. They say a lot of things. I was too busy killing them to count. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Hey, 
There you go. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. You are a lying sack of shit. If I hit escape and go to my journal and there's not more, the next time I see you in person, I'm going to give you a big old slap. You, you lucked out. You have lucked out. All right. Is that everything now? Journal. That's a different planet. I'm not doing that. That's a different planet. Turn to the tower. Cut. Come on. Udin is presenting the Quarian's evidence to the Council. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Venezia. She must be working with the Geth, too. Matriarch Venezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. I can take Saren down. The commander's right. Give it to me. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No. It's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Turian Spectre who betrayed this council. And it was a human who exposed him. I have earned this.
Commander Shepard, step forward. My roommate's currently getting bodied in Elden Ring, and it's very fun to watch. Just thought I'd let y'all know. It is the decision of the council that you be granted all Did you get the kill? privileges of the special tactics and Atta boy, good job, Nick. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Huh? Individuals forged in the fire of service. Yeah, there's a story or something happening. I just heard you say, oh god, turn around and watch you get bodied Spectres and then an kill the wolf. Simple. So good job. The embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace. So I'm a specter now, huh? Last line of defense. How can I be a specter if I'm not dead? You are the first human specter, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. What's my first mission? We're sending you into the Traverse after Saren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. I expected your ambassador to be more grateful. He didn't even thank you. What do you expect from a politician? Come on. Right behind you, Commander. All right. I've got some talents to take care of now. Okay. Let's do... Fill out Intimidate? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Alright. We're gonna give you... Eighteen points. You go there.
that's fine. Okay. Good enough for me. Equipment. Oh god. Shit. Oh, no. Uh, I don't know why I keep doing that in that way. Did I fuck up? I think I fucked up. Maybe not. Alright. You. I wanted that. That this. Good enough for now. I don't care anymore. Okay. Journal, Saren, speak to the ambassador. That's it, right? Oh shit, actually, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I didn't actually read that. Journal, Saren, Ambassador, Cease of Captain. Okay. Central elevator. In other news, Exogenicorp is still denying reports that one of their survey teams has gone missing in the Hades Gamma Cluster. When asked why communication with the survey team was suddenly cut off last week, company officials refused to comment. Ambassador? 
I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. Hmm. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. This isn't right. The Normandy belongs to you. You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I was in your shoes 20 years ago, Shepard. They were considering me for the Spectres. What happened? I failed. I couldn't make the cut. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask me later and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is, I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the Council rejected me. I had my shot. It came and went. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. Saren's not gonna get away this time. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got us Geth scouring the Traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Pharaoh system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharos and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure. Did Morpheus dirty? But if they do exist, it's the not Morpheus. It's Zavala. Bringing them back. Stop Saren from getting the conduit, and we stop the Reapers from returning. I'll stop him. We have one more lead, Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau cluster. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. Your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. I'll take care of Saren. You take care of the political fallout. Not exactly the answer I was looking for, Shepard. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Yes, Commander? How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to an end. Pushing paper, but you're the one who can stop, Saren. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside, so be it. Tell me what happened with you and Saren. It's Sarah. close to 20 years ago now. Ambassador Goyle was our Goyle. representative here on the Citadel. Like Udina, she wanted to get a human into the Spectres. She chose me. The Council sent Saren to keep an eye on me, and evaluate my performance, just like they sent Nihilus to keep tabs on you. I trusted you. You betrayed me. It's not something I'm proud of. I had a chance to become the first human Spectre, and I failed. Saren made sure of that. I think I deserve the whole story. We had intel on a rogue scientist being funded by Batarian interests. He was trying to set up a facility to develop illegal AI technology out in the Verge. Alliance Intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted a Spectre involved. We compromised. I was assigned to help Saren in his investigation. We tracked the scientist to a refining facility on Kamala. He was hidden away somewhere inside, protected by an army of Batarian mercenaries. The plan was simple. Sneak into the plant, capture the scientist, sneak back out. Quick, quiet, and a minimum of bloodshed. I'm guessing things didn't go as planned? Saren and I split up to cover more ground. Then about halfway through the mission, there was a massive explosion in the refinery core. Officially, it was ruled an accident, but I think Saren detonated it on purpose to draw off the enemy guards. Sounds like overkill to me. Mm -hmm. The explosion tore the refinery mm -hmm. to shreds. The whole place was on fire. Black chemical clouds poured out into the atmosphere. Nobody inside survived. There was a camp for the workers and their families nearby. Between the fires and the toxic fumes, the final death count was over 500. Mostly civilians. Saren didn't care. The target was eliminated. Mission accomplished. 
and I ended up taking the blame. That ended all talk of me joining the Spectres. Saren caused the explosion. How'd he pin it on you? In his report, Saren accused me of blowing his cover. He said it was my fault the guards were ready for us. He claimed that's why it turned into a massacre. Saren's report was all the proof the Council needed to kill my chances of becoming a Spectre. Don't blame yourself, Captain. I don't. I blame Saren. I think he wanted things to go bad. He was looking for an excuse to blow that. Thanks for the posture check. Maybe I he appreciate just likes the violence. Maybe he was just trying to make me look bad to keep humans out of the Spectres. If so, he pulled it off. Why'd you let him get away with it? Who do you think the Council was going to listen to? Me? Or their best agent? I had a bad feeling about him right from the start. I should have been more careful. Maybe I could have stopped things before they got out of hand. Don't blame yourself, Captain. I don't. I blame Sarah. Good. You should. I think he He's wanted an things to go bad. He was looking for an excuse to blow that refinery. Maybe he just likes the violence. Maybe he was just trying to make me look bad to keep humans out of the Spectres. If so, he pulled it off. The only thing I care about is stopping Saren. You're right, Commander. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. All right, time to go steal my ship. I mean, take my ship. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Captain Anderson should be the Ugh, one in charge. Excuse me. It's like I'm stealing the ship from him. Yeah, the captain got screwed. But it's not like you could have stopped it. Nobody's blaming you. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's open. You got anything you want to say to the crew? Now's the time. Crew, this is Commander Shepard. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. This is the most important mission any of us have ever been on. The fate of an entire galaxy is at stake. We will stop Saren, no matter what the cost. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. The Captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. Yes, ma'am. Dope. Leave what free XP? In the pot? Oh, I thought it was gonna have me like do a sleep cycle or something. Where'd all my friends go? All the teammates. All just gone. Oh, the elevator? Got it. Let's see if they have anything to say. 
Let's make sure they're all here. I didn't fuck anything up or miss anyone. That is the slowest moving elevator on the planet. That is worse than the elevator in Shadow's apartment building. Garrus and Ashley and Rex. Whoever the hell you are. Tally. Okay. Everybody's good. New apartment has good elevators? Good. Happy for you. You need it. Elevator in your old place sucks. Yeah, I no longer care. We're going upstairs. And we're gonna do a poll to see where we should go first, assuming it's not like on rails. That's probably gonna be what I end up calling it tonight. Probably. Ooh, XP. Ooh, guns. Not oh, I gotta be over there. That's so dumb. Um, there we go. Oh, this map thing is awful. I hate this. All three of you, so okay, all three of us. I got a couple more viewers out there. Anybody else want to join in? Jump in on it. Shadow, you voted. Jelly, you voted. Nick, would you like to vote? <laughs> all right. We're doing the dig site first. Oh. Do I have to go to all of these planets to try to find this? Dig site one, cool. So where, which one of them is it? And why are they all named after Greek cities or city states? The Nosos. Okay, we're gonna get out there, throw down a save. We'll pick this up tomorrow night. You wanna spend any more points while we're sitting here? Posture check, hydrate, I got some water left. What the hell, how many fucking planets are there? Which planet? I lied. We're about to hit about, we're about to hit four hours. And I remembered I have to go to the office tomorrow. So we're going to bed a little early tonight. Which, uh, which planet is it, Chief? I know you know your way around, that's the only reason I'm asking. Unless you're gonna make me hit all these planets, which, fine.
I hope that's the one I just clicked on. I forgot about the car thing.